Hey guys, RSG Mizzer here, bringing you a search and destroy in quarry. Um, I recorded this last night, right after I got my rapid fire controller, which I'll talk to you about. Um, and I just got back from school, and I'm going to do a little commentary on it. So, the first thing is, if you haven't watched my unboxing, you can go watch that if you want to learn a little bit more about the controller. I don't go into depth about anything about the controller. It's just basically an unboxing, um, and I show a little bit about it, where I bought it from uh, Sandoval Mods. Um, the class I'm using in this search and destroy is the foul with, um, the reason I'm using a foul obviously is because I got the rapid fire controller and I want to use the foul fully auto, so, um, my class has, um, bling on it using the holographic sight and the uh, silencer. I'll tell you why I'm using the holographic sight in a second and give you a little bit of tips on that, but, um, I'm using hardline. And the reason for that is because the foul is already strong enough. You don't need stopping power. You don't need any of that. Um, here, here is my first kill if you want to watch. See how fast the gun goes. But, um, yeah, you don't need stopping power or any of that. You don't need to a, any stronger than it already is, especially with the fact I'm playing fully auto. So I used hard line and steady aim just in case, you know, you go around the corner. And I can just pretty much blast at him and get him with the fact that I have steady aim on it'll be a lot easier and the reason that I'm using the holographic sight as I said I was going to talk to you about is because you may not believe it but I've seen it on Machinima and it's true with the holographic sight on the damage of the foul goes from 35 to 40 so it gives it a 5 damage boost which probably doesn't seem like a lot but really like it is no matter what where you are on the map it's a two shot kill now automatically if they're damaged obviously it's a one shot kill um also the other reason it gives you a little bit of an accuracy boost less recoil which with fully auto that's that's awesome obviously um and the reason you should never use, if you use the red dot on your FAL, you really shouldn't because it actually, the reason that I don't use it, and it's because if you go into a private match yourself, just try this one time, and you put on the red dot, wherever you shoot with your red dot, the bullet with, ju this is only on this gun, the foul, but where, wherever you shoot, the bullet actually goes to the bottom right of the red dot. So I know you're pr you're probably thinking, oh, no big deal, not that big of a difference in accuracy. But I'm just thinking, like, what if I'm shooting at a guy and I'm just shooting the corner of him and he doesn't die just because the fact that my bullet's dropping to the right. So that's that's what I'm thinking behind all this. But I'm sure it's not that bad. But that's why I use the holographic sight anyways. Um, better accuracy, more damage, why not use it? Even more of a reason not to use stopping power on this class. Use a useful perk like Hardline, Cold-Blooded, anything really is a lot more useful than stopping power. Personally, I was hoping that they would take stopping power out for this game. Because without stopping power, there's no point in stopping power really because almost everyone uses it, so almost everyone has the same gun damage. And without stopping power, what I was hoping was that it would give us all a chance to use the useful perks. Like Cold-Blooded Pro, um, what am I, Hardline, all the useful perks instead of stupid stopping power. I'm glad they took out Juggernaut though and put Martyrdom as a death perk. That was the three things I was hoping, that stopping power, Juggernaut, and Martyrdom would be gone. And basically they are other than stopping power, which isn't a huge deal. Um, so, the controller that you've seen me using with the Foul Fully Auto, I got it yesterday, um, in the mail from eBay, from, as I said, Sandoval Mods, that's S-A-N-D-O-V-L, V-A-L Mods, sorry. This is an 8-mode rapid fire controller, it's, most of the modes are useless to me, but it seemed like the best 
legit company that was making controllers on eBay. It wasn't too pricey, so I decided to get it. Um, most of the modes are useless. The first mode is the one I use most, and then mode 7 I might use when I'm using a Kimbo, because that's what it's for. And other than that, in some other games I can use the other modes if I need. But, um... Yeah, if you want to know just if you want to know all the modes in detail, just watch my unboxing video. That'll give you a better idea. Um, one more thing is, if you guys haven't yet, I've been asking people to download it. But me and Witness have made a toolbar for our clan, um, RSG Gaming. It's really good. Like from it, if you download it. You can get to our website, you can get to channels of all our teams. It's not done being created yet, but it's looking pretty good. I made a logo for it. It's the same logo that's in the bottom of this video. So it's pretty cool. Um, it'll help us out a lot if you download it. It'll help you get around our videos a lot if you download it. So I don't see why you wouldn't. But, um... Anyways, in this game, the I'll talk about my um, kill streaks. My kill streaks I forgot to change. So right now I have Predator, um, Harrier, and Pavlo. Really not perks that I'd normally use in search. I'd normally use uh, probably um, UAV, Predator, and something else depending on what kind of mood I was in or what gun I was using. But I did end up not changing them, so I had to use these perks, which doesn't end up hurting me. They end up coming in use because I do go flawless this game. I end up with a score of 10 and 0. Um, here we go. I'm using my predator, and here we go. Ready? Oh, what is that? A triple in a search and destroy with a predator missile. So I put out my pavlo. And I put out my Harrier because I know this is going to be the last round. If it wasn't the last round, then I don't know what I'd be doing wrong. But yeah, it ends up being the last round. So our team goes 4-0. I go 10-0. Flawless game. Basically, the gun, I'm just going to talk to you about the turbo fact. There you go. There's another kill with it. You see, it just fully auto guns. It is so much better than just not having a fully auto foul. I know it's cheap. I probably won't use it all the time. Um, I probably won't use it that much, but just it's awesome having the fully auto. Using pistols fully auto is honestly so much fun. I don't. I don't think I got any pistol kills in this game, but it's really fun. So um, I'll be posting up more videos soon. Just check out um the toolbar, please. Download it. Here, I got scared, I didn't want to die, and ran away, but, yep, yeah, check out the toolbar, please download it, um, I'm gonna be making more videos, so check those out, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later, and there's the score, 10-0, so, have a good day, guys, see ya.